I've got everything set up except for knowing what we're gonna record today. Need to put a YouTube video up in an hour. Yeah, in an hour. Need to put a video up in an hour. In an hour. Right, so, what can we hear? No, straight. I need, I need that. Good enough. I'll take it. Alright, I know the audio on this video is absolutely terrible. I'm using the scratch mic. Uh, the lighting is terrible. I'm using the... What the hell is going on with this YouTube channel? Let me explain. So, things have been changing quite a bit recently. I used to shoot videos at my old place, at my mum's, and I'm now shooting most of my videos here in my family home. It's really nice to be able to shoot videos here. It's nice to feel comfortable enough that my family would accept me talking to a camera for hours on end. It's a really weird thing, you know, when, you, when you're in a relationship and you've got a kid and everything else, and all of a sudden there's the boyfriend or the husband standing there talking to a camera. It's a very weird scenario. I want to do something different with this channel, and I want to be able to share more of a story. Recently, it's just been me making the most generic kind of videos, one of my favorite video games, my views on YouTube as a whole, but I want it to be more than that. I want to be able to actually tell a story through this camera and through a vlog. Get shit, get bored. When I started this channel, I wanted it to be about accessibility and how easy it is for people to be able to pick up their phone, their mobile device, their tablet, whatever. Oh, that's quite nice lighting. And I wanted to show people that it's easy just to be able to hit record and share a story. And that's what I've done through this channel for the last couple of months. But now, as you can see, we're stepping up production game. We're shooting on an actual professional camera. The audio and everything else is going to come on later. I have the equipment, but I want to show in my YouTube videos the transition from starting with this, working your way up to this, and eventually transitioning into proper storytelling with professional gear and it's not so much because I want to mimic what other people have to do in order to make that transition it's more just to show that it isn't the camera you use it isn't the lights that surround you it isn't the microphone that's pointing towards you now I don't consider myself a particularly good storyteller but what I try to do is be able to communicate a story in a very simple way that other people can understand and show people what I mean through demonstration rather than just simple explanation and what I mean by that is rather than telling you how to make a tea I would rather just show you and then go and make a tea for the baby. Show now? Yeah, alright, sorry. Welcome to the nursery. I never realized that finding space in a house with a baby would have been so hard. Thank you for the bottle. How can I help you? I don't worry. You're gonna knock the camera in there. It's quite expensive, so if you could, like. Daddy. Yeah. Oh, no. I love you too, sweetie. I mean, if you knock that over, it's really. It's gonna be a pain in the ass, because if it falls this way, that's. That's great. Sorry. It's okay. Don't apologize. So what have we learned from this lesson? Are you gonna okay. keep on knocking cameras over? I mean, I probably should have moved it. It's, it's mostly my fault. I mean, it's entirely uh, my fault, really. Dumb. So over the. Uh, uh, uh. So over the. Uh, oh my God! It's so annoying. Over the last couple of months, I've been playing around with some different types of videos and different things that I'm interested in, like tested series where I played around with some apps and sort of recommended my favorite ones to you. I've done some challenges and brought other people in to just basically have fun in front of a camera. But I'm at a stage now where I really want to start taking YouTube Daddy, seriously and Daddy. sharing a story in something that means more to me than a simple challenge video or whatever. I'll carry on making that type of content just for shits and giggles. Oh, sorry. I I've learned that word. So I guess the whole point of this video is to announce that I am getting back into daily vlogs. I feel like I need to push myself creatively. I've been slacking a little bit, getting lazy in terms of editing and even recording, like the color grading on the last video. Ugh, mate, no, Ugh, no. So starting tomorrow, I guess we're gonna be doing daily vlogs. Some days I might just do it on Snapchat and simply upload that video. I need that incentive. I need to keep pushing myself. So thank you for watching today's video. If you are interested in daily vlogs, be sure to leave a comment below and subscribe to the channel to watch them. Are you excited for daily vlogs? Well, You gonna say it with me? Say daily vlogs. Say daily vlogs. Daily vlogs.
also got a cat. Um, hey. No, you meant to be the... No, come here. Right, you ready? Woo! <laughs>